Hannah Skirty Molinar commutes to campus every day. Berkeley was just always the place to be growing up here. Like everyone wanted to go to Berkeley and like hang out. And I guess I never really realized the real problem with the housing. <laughs> While the one-hour commute from her hometown in Vallejo is cheaper as a transfer student, she still has to pay bridge toll and fill her gas tank twice a week. I actually put myself through school. Um, I have since I went to community college. I work five nights a week as a waitress. After attending morning classes, she drives back home to work, then commutes back to campus for classes at night. With lack of affordable housing and growing financial costs, students are commuting as far as three hours just to make it to class. The Guardian reports that more than 50% of students at some universities commute from home. With the overcrowding of UC Berkeley, U.S. News & World Report says that 75% of students here live off campus. For students like Hannah, commuting impacts social life and academics. And she's not alone. You come here, it's like you're drained, but you try to make the most of it out of every day. Transfer student Donovan Chu has an hour commute on BART from the end of the line at Millbrae every day. He carves out time to meet with friends after studying in transit. It's not as easy as most people think. You have to know, you have to literally juggle three balls at the same time. The mere mention of being a commuter student, he says, comes with a heavy stigma. And while the university scrambles to accommodate its students, students like Hannah and Donovan continue to go the extra mile. Thomas Maglonia for Cal TV News.